right, here's my next boiler. Now the boiler itself on this one is 7 inch diameter, 16 inches tall, just the boiler. It has uh, nine three-quarter copper tubes rolled in, and the total height, including the stack, is 40 inches. Got a really nice Luckenheimer whistle on it. I built the hand pump because there are no small hand pumps this size on the market. This is your airlock valve right here. But uh, gets an airlock in the pump. A really nice firebox on it, really big, holds a lot of wood. I'll send this tool along with it. Good draft. These petcock or these tricocks here are off a of Creter's engine, I believe. Creter's boiler. Really nice. They're really small, so that kind of inspired this small boiler. Never seen anything like it before. Really nice. The pop-off valves, there's two of them on it. This one's set at 80, and this one's at 100. A small gauge there. I've been running it for a couple hours out here. Uh, there's an engine out valve or right here on the back side of it. It's looking him right there. Water coming out of there. Anyway. That's it. I think this is my, uh, oh gosh, must be at least the 62nd boiler that I've built, the smallest I've ever built. And that's, like I was saying, these two little valves, the tri tricocks, are what, finding those is what inspired this. Blowdown valve is right here. Blow it down every hour or so of running. Get the crap out of the bottom of the boiler. And that's about it.